What is Clomid and how does it work? Clomid is an oral medication that can be used to stimulate ovulation. It works by blocking estrogen receptors at the hypothalamus, which is an important hormonal control center for the body. When this happens, the hypothalamus is stimulated to release follicle-stimulating hormone, and luteinizing hormone. These are the naturally occurring ovarian stimulants, which prompt ovulation in a normal cycle. Why has my doctor recommended Clomid? Clomid can be helpful for those trying to get pregnant who have any of the following problems. Irregular ovulation, it is difficult to conceive when a woman's cycles are so irregular that she can't be sure when she is ovulating. When effective, the use of Clomid should produce a predictable ovulatory response to allow for timed intercourse or intrauterine insemination. Male Factor Fertility Problems when there is a problem with the semen quality, sometimes your physician may recommend intrauterine insemination to maximize the chance of pregnancy. Clomid can be used to help improve the timing of the inseminations with the woman's cycle. Unexplained infertility. Clomid has also been shown to be effective in increasing pregnancy rates in young healthy couples that have had an entirely normal fertility evaluation but still are having trouble getting pregnant. How is Clomid prescribed? What can I expect to feel? When you first begin your period, call the office so that we may schedule an examination in the next 2-3 days. At your appointment, your doctor will perform a pelvic exam, and finalize the timing of your Clomid cycle. Typically you will take 1-3 to three tablets a day for 5 days early in your cycle, cycle days 3-7 or 4-8. During this time, some women will notice hot flashes, moodiness, or sleep pattern changes. Most patients notice no symptoms at all. Ovulation will typically occur 7-8 days following completion of the Clomid treatment. Because the ovaries are stimulated, you may notice some bloating, or discomfort with intercourse. Verifying ovulation may be done in several ways. Your doctor will recommend which method is most appropriate, these include basal body temperature testing, LH kit testing, office ultrasound, and blood tests. At your visit, your physician will instruct you as to when to expect ovulation in that cycle, when to time intercourse, and if, when you need to return for a follicle scan ultrasound to confirm ovulation. How will I know if I'm pregnant? Check a pregnancy test at home. If you do not have your menses within two to three weeks of the expected time of ovulation. If your period starts, call on the first day, so that we may schedule you for another cycle. How many cycles of Clomid should be taken? This depends on a number of different factors that are specific to each patient. Your physician can outline an overall fertility plan so that you know the long-term goals and when additional medications or treatments may be indicated. What are the risks of Clomid? 1. Rarely women will have hyperstimulation of the ovaries as a result of Clomid use. In this case the ovaries become enlarged with multiple follicles. Severe pain or marked swelling of the abdomen should prompt you to call your doctor. 2. The chance of multiple ovulations is slightly higher with Clomid than with a normal menstrual cycle. The chance of twins resulting from Clomid is 6 to 8 percent. There is no increased risk of higher order multiples over the baseline rate in the population. 3. Rare side effects include visual changes, reversible hair thinning, dizziness, or hives. 4. Patients with currently existent large ovarian cysts or liver disease should not use Clomid. 5. There has been discussion as to whether multiple cycles of ovarian stimulatory drugs increase the risk of ovarian cancer. Overall, studies have shown no increase in a woman's risk of ovarian cancer taking clomiphene with other infertile women.